Hello everybody, how's it going? My name's Happy, welcome back to the Chasecraft Creative Server. It is October, which means we are going to be going through 10 of the best Halloween plots. Just to clarify, these may not be the best, you, you may find better, but this was interesting. In at number 10, we have this plot from Chemmaster73. Now, we're mainly going to be focusing on one corner of this build, and that is over here, where the Halloween stuff begins. Starts with a sign, Happy Halloween! You have to do it. I mean, I'm not sure what it is we have to do, but apparently we have to do it. Sign says so, so, I mean, I, I, I know what you have to do. Subscribe, hit the bell, don't miss another episode. Okay, things are activating. What, what else we got around here? Um, oh, we're coming up to a giant skeleton. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is, I, I like this guy. I like this guy. He, he's cool. Like, I want, I want to be friends with this guy, but he's already got a friend. He's got a pumpkin. This is a really cool build. I'm, I'm really liking this. Um, to say it's a number 10, really good start. Really good start to this video. Really good start to the plots. Um, what do you guys think? What do you guys think to this plot? Let us know in the comments. We'll move on. So here we have it everybody, this is number 9, this is a plot by Pandeli, and I really rather like this one, uh, the house over there looks really nice, I really like the ruins, the vines used, the different textures, the mossy cobblestone mixed in with normal cobblestone, stone bricks, and mossy stone bricks as well, really nice texturing using the grass as well with the mushrooms and the podzole, and of course we come out here and we've got ourselves a little bit of a grave area, a little bit of a, a graveland, a grave yard each sign has text on it as well which is really cool really nice details there this is looking like a really good number nine plot really good halloween plot as well and the house as well you're probably thinking hey happy this isn't a, a halloween house and you know you're you're, you're not wrong uh, it's not very spooky if i was to live here and have ruins and graveyards outside and unfinished builds i mean that could be haunted for all we know i i, I wouldn't feel too comfortable myself this is a very eerie house i'm gonna get out of here right now but yeah Really nice build, really good loving like Halloween build. Can, can you put Halloween and love together? I, I don't think it quite works like that, does it? So yeah, another nice plot. Uh, what's around the back here actually? Looks like they've got a little hedge area. Yeah, you got yourself a little tree, a little swimming pool. Gotta have a swim in the swimming pool, even though uh, anything could be in that swimming pool. But yeah, this is a really nice plot by Pandeli. As I say, really like the ruins. Some really nice details over there with the bed inside, making it almost look like a ruined village. Um, there could have been there could have been a story here, a little bit of lore. You know, the single plant pot. Oh man. This place tells a story, and I want to—I want to get to the bottom of this story. Like, why, why are there all of those people over there? Why is there a house that has nobody in it, and all the furniture's gone? Why is there an unfinished building and the ruins? This plot has got a story to it, and if you guys think you can come up with a story for this plot, let us know in the comments. What story do you have for this plot? Here we go, another graveyard plot. Coming in, number eight is Unshapen Junk 21 with their graveyard build. Another small build, but another nice build. Small, but packed of little details, like uh, like even more signs. We've got, we've got stuff underneath the graves. For example, in here, we've got... Oh, oh, I, I'm so sorry. Oh, no. Oh, dude. And you didn't even have a name. Oh... Oh, it's terrible news, everybody. So yeah, this is a graveyard, and uh, whilst getting the cinematic footage for that, I kind of got jump scared by a, a vine. So at the end of this walkway, then, we have this little room, and inside here, not much in here, apart from doors that break, because I use 1.14. And inside, yeah, we've got a nice little room, not much going on inside here, but I don't think that matters. I think all that matters is we've got doors that don't want to work for me. <laughs> we've got a really nice glass window which excuse the fact that it looks like a prison bar. That's the fact that I'm using 1.14. Maybe I should use 1.8 for these videos instead. You can overlook an unspeakable head which is on a different plot. But yeah, another nice um, little graveyard plot. Some really nice details like the um, graves having chests in. Again, you've got the names as well and the dates. Oh, I see. <gasps> Some dates unknown oh that's really clever <laughs> so 
so coming in at number seven, we have this rather variety-based plot by Scario MC. Now, as I get stuck on these bars, we see a nice little landscaping area. So let's try and let's try and jump over these bars and see if we can do this. Huh, uh, we're through. Okay, wait. Oh, we are. We made it. Nice. Okay, let's climb up here onto this rather nice little island. I like how they themed this to the Halloween style. And even if not, it still looks very spoopy with the pumpkins down there, the, the cobwebs. This is a rather nice plot. I quite like this one, actually. I quite like the variety. I'm really, really looking forward to trying that maze over there. Um, and then, of course, you've got the pumpkin over here. We've got these everyone's favourite spooky pumpkin. We've got the crop field. Um, we've got some some pods all on the ground we've got some sort of like thing going up to the stem of the pumpkin uh, does the pumpkin have a face nope nope this pumpkin is yet to be carved so if you'd like to come and carve this pumpkin head online to the server information will be below i mean you can't really carve the pumpkin but hey if you ever want to see your build on one of these videos, make sure you make it good. Make sure you come onto the server. Information in the, in the description below. And uh, log on to the creative server. Maybe you'll find your video here one day. It's time to, for me to go and conquer that maze. I don't normally get scared by mazes, but if it's to do with Halloween, then I get scared. Okay, we're in. We're in the maze. This is it. We're going. Always stick to the left. I've always always done that and i've already failed i've already failed the first rule of this hey at least i know that there's a roller coaster at the end of this oh my goodness i've just thought of a way i could cheat this but what's cheating when you're playing a maze right you know you, you can't you can't just cheat when you're in a maze that's not how mazes work so come on everybody who thinks we're gonna get this who thinks we're gonna get this if you think i'm gonna get this maze leave a like on this video right now if you think i'm not gonna make it subscribe uh i didn't follow the left i'm, I'm not I'm not following the rules of mazes, everybody. I'm so sorry. I'm not following the rules of... Hey, we did it. Okay, everyone, you got to leave a like on this video. Ooh, what that was lava. Ooh, look at this. we got a maze. Are there minecarts in there? Oh, there's minecarts. Okay, I don't want to make you run out of minecarts, my guy. So let's have a ride on this roller coaster then. Final drop. Oh, my... Whoa, okay. I wasn't expecting it to be an actual drop. Oh, my goodness. Whoa. Okay, that was fun. Wow, I wasn't expecting there to be an actual drop at the end. Oh my goodness. Okay, that was a really good plot by um, Scario MC. Really good plot. Really enjoyed that. The maze was fun. Wow, that's a much smaller maze than I thought. I was making that really hard for myself. Really fun maze. Really enjoyed it. Really nice plot. Loved the Halloween stuff over here. Let's move on. Coming in at number six, we have Hunter Brock 9, and I am very, very excited to see this build. Look at this build. Oh my gosh. They've got boardings up at the window, the trees, the custom trees. My goodness. How? What? The ground is questionable. You know, the, the ground doesn't even matter. Look at this thing. Okay, so admittedly not very detailed from the back, but I don't think that really matters. Like, the front of this build is oh so beautiful. This is number six. Just imagine what we've got in store for numbers five, four, three, two, one. This is an amazing build. I love the detail on it. Like, is there, is there anything inside? I haven't looked inside yet. Just breaking in. Don't, don't, don't mind me. Okay, so what have we got down here? We've got a little table. Okay, a cobweb in Infested table. Anything over here? Oh, we've got... Oh, look at that. You can't get through there. Ah, and what's upstairs? Anything upstairs? Oh, man, no, but this is just just as eerie. Oh, my goodness. And you can't get outside. Wait, there is a room in here. Oh, uh, uh, okay. Won't ask questions. Yo, this place is... Hey, I, I can't get out. <laughs> no, excuse... Help, help, I'm out, I'm out. Oh, okay, I'm leaving this place right now. Oh my goodness, I'm stuck in the cobwebs. This is not good. Oh, okay, I'm stuck in your base. Please let me out of your base. If you go in there, you're never coming out. That's 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 the truth. You're going to get stuck in a little room. But man, the details on this build. Absolutely insane. Absolutely amazing. Is that smoke coming out the chimney? I haven't even flown up here yet. Whoa, Hunter Brock. Loving the detail. Great plot. Number six. Coming in at number five, we have an old friend of ours. This is a plot by Exelar, and if you missed a video that we released recently, uh, myself and Skylary tried getting into this safe house. Now, this is kind of a Halloween theme build because it's got the lava, the cobwebs. I want to give this another go, and um, 
I, I want to see see if I can see if I can beat this parkour. We're gonna probably give this um two or two or three goes. And hey, speak of the devil, look who's online, Ixalar. Hey, it's almost like this was planned. We've gotta give this a go. We got we gotta do this. Last time I tried this with Skylary, bad, bad things happened. Now, granted, me and Skylary didn't manage to get past this bit at all, but it doesn't look like the parkour actually gets inside the safe house. So how does one get inside the safe house? I kind of want to see if I can complete the parkour from here, though. Oh, okay, ice parkour. Mate, we, we need we need, we need unspeakable on here. We, we need to get Nathan. Maybe we can bring Sky back and we, me and her can uh, try out this parkour again. So what does it actually say? Well done, you've completed the hard parkour. So if you guys think you can get inside of this uh, safe house or just complete the parkour, pop online to the server. All the details will be in the description uh, on how you can join along with the minecraft versions but this plot's really nice like it's not a halloween plot to be precise but this is it's so near to halloween this plot i almost get the spooks like this is a spooky safe house my goodness Ooh, this one seems promising. This one is by Asian Plainboy, and this is the number four plot for today for the Halloween builds. This is a really cool build because of the skeleton. I mean, look at that guy. What is it? First of all, yo, okay. Super derpy, super derpy little guy. Oh my gosh, the detail. Small build, again, but some of these builds have been very short and sweet today, and I think that's what makes a build. It's, uh, oh, <laughs> okay, I've just noticed something. Do, do, do you have any sort of relationship to this guy? Um, are, are you all right, buddy? Oh no, I've just realized this has become a lot more, oh dear, dude, I'm so sorry. Here, let, 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 let me revive you, okay? Let me just revive you. Uh, okay, we're in, we're in. So may, maybe he's alive in there, may, maybe he's all right. As I, as I look at his mouth, his eyes are still open. He, he seems all right, this guy seems fine. I, I don't really want to die today, so just just gonna leave you to it, Um, but bye. Coming in at number three, we have one Rico 8 with their rather um, interesting build. Is it a maze? Is it a... Uh, hello, 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 Moose. Hello, Preston. Hello, Nathan. Hello, ASDF. Hello, um... Shark and hello one Rico eight. You all died on the same date with one 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 Rico eight. Co coincidental? Maybe? Maybe not? What what is going on? I'm just gonna leave you to it and we're gonna go this way. Whoa! Whoa, the tower! Okay, we'll definitely go and check the towers out in a minute. I'm really liking this so far. I like the walls, I like the hey. Hang on a second, we've got something. What do we got? What do we got? It, I just completely walked through that. Okay, just a nice simple tunnel. Nice. I like these, even though normally these are meant to look like that. Oh, there we go. Kind of, kind of fixing. It's meant to look like this. This is really nice. I like this walkway. Let's go see what the tower is all about. Oh yeah, and make sure you use 35% off at the store. Store.chasecraft.gg <laughs> So we're just going down the tower right now and uh, I can barely see anything right now. I kind of know where the stairs are. If it wasn't for these redstone torches, then I'd probably get lost. What's out here? Okay, we've got a little room with some mossy <laughs> mossy cobblestone. Oh, sorry, mossy stone bricks. This is a nice room. Nice little eating room. We've got a master's chair. Another room in here. Where does this lead to? Oh, some stairs. Oh, Little bedroom. This is really nice though, like, I really like the details, I liked all the little rooms, I like how hidden everything is as well. This is really nice, like, can I can I buy this castle off you? H how much are you selling this for, Rico? H how much are you selling the castle for, mate? Let us know in the comments below. Taking the number two spot today is Shadow Flame MC with their rather rather nice build i mean look at the detail here we've got cobwebs everywhere we've got skeleton heads we've got pumpkins we've got detailed walls we've got hedges with a skeletons either even just to add to the mix what else have we got around here i am getting lost in here we've got cobwebs with pathways that we can't get to what else have we got we've got a really nice water feature with again some more wither skeletons main skeletons jack-o-lanterns I really like this, the redstone torches. You kind of wonder what these places will look like at night time. Here, let's do some parkour. Let's let's get round these. Um, I really like this place, man. 
Again, an, a, another small one. It's got a big profile to it, but hey, oh, well, hold on, wait a minute, what's that? Let's get inside the door. Oh, no, we're not getting inside this door. Oh, we are. Okay. Ooh. Whoa. Whoa. This place is so dark. Oh, trick or treat. No, thanks. No, I'm, I, 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 I pass. Thanks. Uh, <laughs> what's up here? Okay. So it looks like an unfinished build up here, but man, this is really good. Like I have high hopes for this build. And uh, if you want to come online and check out any of the builds you've seen, by the way, today, pop online to the server. Uh, IP address will be down below and you can come and visit any of the plots. Uh, the names should be on the screen somewhere with the, with the names of the plots, the people's names and you can come along and find them but yeah really like this plot a good entry for number two from uh shadow master shadow flame the sticky notes won't open don't blame me blame the sticky notes Number one, number one, it's me, Cookie. What a beautiful plot this is. The terraforming, the caves, oh sorry, the mountainsides, the trees, the archways, the pathways, the little baby zombies, oh my goodness. You're so cute and adorable. This is a really cool plot. Uh, oh, rest in peace, burn, Mr. Cookie. Are you the son of Mr. Cookie or it's me, Cookie? Oh, <gasps> yo. That's a nice little feature. I'm really liking this plot. Rest in peace, Galactic Phantom. This is a really nice plot. I'm, I mean, the dead tree almost looks like a dead bush. Just the, ter I mean, everything about this plot. It goes all around here as well. We've got more dead trees, more, more water, even bits that haven't been complete yet. I mean, the work that's gone into this plot is amazing. And that's why this plot deserves number one. But every single plot was good today. Thank you, everybody, for coming along onto the build server on Chasecraft and building your plots. If you want to build your plot, uh, the information will be down in the description on how you can join the server. Uh, it's free to join if you have Minecraft Java Edition. And yeah, come online, build a plot. And maybe one day you'll see your plot in one of these episodes, the top five creative plot videos. Hope you enjoyed this bonus video, top 10 Halloween builds for October. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like. If you really liked it, subscribe, hit the bell. My stuff will be down below as well if you want to check me out on YouTube. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time for another video here on the Chasecraft channel. Bye-bye. Uh,